greetings for the holiday season. And for some it is Christmas, for others it is Hanukkah, and I'm sure there must be other festivals around also. So all good wishes and greetings for all the different festivities, but also greetings for the coming year ahead. And when I think about this season of holiday time, it's a time for giving gifts. And of course, we've heard this expression that it's in the giving that there is receiving. And so what is it that I have that I can give? Yes, chocolates and books and scarves and hats and all of that is fine, absolutely. But is there something more that I can give? Well, this is also a season in which we talk about good wishes and good tidings and God's blessings for all, and let there be peace on earth. So maybe this can be part of our giving also. Is it possible for me to have a heart that's completely clean and have nothing, nothing, nothing but good wishes for everyone? Yes, I remember the divine and I'm able to draw that light and love within myself then as a result of that, yes, definitely, surely, the heart can be filled with nothing but good wishes for every single member of the human family. And sometimes it's easier to send good wishes and God's light and love to those who are far away. But what about my neighbours? What about the people I live with in the same home? Can I also have nothing but good wishes for each and every one of them? Yes, for sure. If I've experienced God's grace and God's blessings in my own life, then my own heart is filled with benevolence and I'm able to share benevolence with all. Also, if I've experienced unconditional love from the divine and I've stored that within myself and experienced how it helps me at all times. My heart grows bigger and I'm able to share that love with all. Spiritual love, very different to physical love, but a love that's able to reach out and with compassion and cooperation, support and help others on their journey. Can I have that feeling of belonging to everyone, whoever it is I'm in touch with, whoever I'm in contact with, whoever I meet, and those who are closest to me. Apart from physically living close to others, is there a sense of belonging? And yes, I can have all of those feelings and experiences if I have spiritual awareness and spiritual consciousness of the inner being and my own identity so that I see others with that same vision of spirituality and seeing the intrinsic goodness that lies within them. So have a very happy festive season, but also let me prepare for the coming year. I don't know what the challenges will be, but for sure, life will have challenges. And so even before the challenges come, and I spend some time in reflection, and usually 1st of January is a time when most people set aside a little bit of time for reflection, just thinking about what the future holds. And so this year, can I think about what is it that I need to change within myself to be able to move forward? in my own life. And yes, maybe I'm thinking about my spiritual journey and is it possible for me to take a few steps forward in that so that I discover the truth about myself, the beautiful things that lie within, but also the things that I haven't wanted to see perhaps, but am I now strong enough and ready to see the things that I need to change within myself so that my life becomes more peaceful and filled with inner joy and contentment 
so that I'm able to share this with all those who I'm in touch with. Because whatever is going on inside gets expressed outside and it will definitely impact everyone around me. So have a beautiful festive holiday season and a wonderful year ahead. Yes, there'll be challenges, but we can also draw power from the divine so that we have the capacity to be able to deal with all those challenges. And I'm sure that can happen for each and every one. Thank you. Om Shanti.